And we've been inside the courtroom all day gathering the latest in this case. Thanks for joining us on 13 News Now at 6. I'm Janet Roach. And I'm David Allen. 28-year-old Casey M. Tinsley is facing charges in connection to the nine-month-old's death last November. 13 News Now reporter Allie Weatherton has the latest in Norfolk. Kasim Tinsley's attorney, Melinda Seymour, says her client is standing by his innocence. So he claims every time I go to see him that nothing has happened. He doesn't understand why he's there. Tinsley is charged with second degree murder in the death of his nine month old daughter, Michaela. The assistant medical examiner testified in court today, saying the baby died of blunt force trauma to the head. She had skull fractures, chest bruising, and brain hemorrhages. The night before Michaela died, several people and kids stayed in the house with Tinsley, while Tinsley's girlfriend had to work. A 19 year old man testified, saying that night he heard a baby crying and believes it was Michaela. He says he then heard Tinsley wake up and swear, then heard what sounded like someone trip. Soon after that, the baby stopped crying, but Tinsley's attorney says Tinsley claims he didn't hurt her. He misses the kids, he loves his kids. He wants to be home with his kids. When Tinsley's girlfriend got home from work the next morning, she found the baby with bruising on her face, cold and not breathing. Baby Michaela was taken to the hospital where she later died. But Tinsley's attorney says right now there's no evidence linking him to the crime. I'm very concerned about that. I mean, he was there along with four or five other people. The case will now head to a grand jury, then it'll go to trial. In Norfolk, Allie Weatherton, 13 News Now.